to The Written, a recurring podcast featuring student works of fiction, short fiction, poetry, and more. Today, December 2020, Delaware County Community College graduate Alyssa Tino brings you 11 tips to help you succeed during your college journey. Enjoy the show. Dear listeners, my name is Alyssa and I'm graduating from Delaware County Community College in December 2020. First of all, I want to tell you that I'm really happy you've decided to pursue a degree at Delaware County Community College. I think it's a worthwhile investment. I know it's been hard being at college during a pandemic and I'm sorry if you've had to struggle with any barriers, mental, financial, physical, etc. However, the fact that you're even listening to this podcast proves you've come a long way. What I've learned is that no two college students are alike, but there are pieces of advice that could apply to universally all of them. You've probably heard of some before, but they have proven helpful to me. I hope you'll take them seriously. One, don't be afraid to ask for help. There's no such thing as a silly question. Asking for help shows that you can self-advocate, and that speaks volumes to professors, colleagues, and future employers. Two, Along those lines, don't be afraid to do things on your own terms. Yes, you have to follow directions given to you to complete regular college-related tasks. I mean that you should never have to follow anyone else's path but your own. Take the classes you have always wanted to try, but that don't seem quote-unquote cool. Seek out friendships instead of letting others come to you. Sign up for clubs and organizations that you can actually commit to. Anything that sparks your interests are the right things for you. Three, be nice to your professors and fellow classmates. Remember that they're human too. Treat them the way you would wanna be treated. Four, if you have any intellectual curiosity, please indulge it. You'll find college to be such an enriching experience if you choose to learn for its own sake. Five, respect your own time and set boundaries. If you find yourself taking on too much, it's okay to scale back. If you make a good case for it, people will understand. Six, you can't do any, six, you can't do everything when your emotional cup is not full. Make time for the things that make you happy. Seven, pay attention to deadlines. Use a paper or digital planner and break assignments up into manageable pieces. I find the iOS Reminders app extremely helpful. Eight, don't be afraid of receiving feedback. The ability to learn from criticism is probably the single most important skill you can ever develop. Think about it. If you spend precious psychological energy ruminating about the motives of the person giving you the feedback or resisting or lamenting about how you could have done it better, you miss out on valuable information. That info tells you how you can learn to improve your strategies and develop resiliency. Nine, practice helpful self-talk. Whether as reciting affirmations or combating thoughts that make you feel bad about yourself or whatever else, You'll train your brain to look for the positivity in your life. 10. Keep supportive people close to you, people who always will have your back. I don't think this needs explanation. 11. Lastly, remember that you are so much more than grades or degrees. It does feel good to accomplish your goals, but it's so much more satisfying to enjoy and appreciate the life you are living. Congrats on all your hard work. Take care of yourselves. Alyssa. You've been listening to The Written brought to you by the New Media Lab and Campus Life. Congrats to DCCC alum Alyssa Tino, who wrote, produced, and hosted this episode. She was a valued member of our organization, and we wish her well. My name is Professor Maria Boyd, the faculty advisor for the New Media Lab. If you have an interest in joining our student organization, please reach out to the Office of Campus Life and we'll be in touch. We welcome all skill levels, including beginners. You can participate on the mic or behind the scenes on our production teams. Any currently enrolled Delaware County Community College student with a GPA of 2.0 or higher is eligible to participate. We hope to hear from you and thanks again for listening.